Good evening, I am Airman Tyree Cannon, A1C in the United States Air Force. My job is air traffic control. In a brief synopsis, I separate aircraft, talk to multiple pilots a day and adjacent facilities, keep them safe while they're flying through the air. So if one day you are looking in the sky and you see a plane, you're like, well, how do they not touch each other? That's me. And tonight I have brought one of my favorite books. It's a uh, Christmas tradition in my household. It's called Frosty the Snowman. It's written by Steve Nelson and Jack Rollins and illustrated by Sam Williams. Let's get into the book. Frosty, the snowman, was a jolly, happy soul with a corn cob pipe and a button nose and two eyes made out of coal. Frosty, the snowman, is a fairy tale, they say. He was made of snow, but the children know how he came to life one day. There must have been some magic in that old silk hat they found, for when they placed it on his head, he began to dance around. Frosty, the snowman, was alive as he could be, and the children say he could laugh and play just the same as you and me. Frosty, the snowman, knew the sun was hot that day, so he said, let's run and we'll have some fun before I melt away. Down to the village with a broomstick in his hand, running here and there all around the square, saying, catch me if you can. He led them down the streets of town right to the traffic cop, and he only paused a moment when he heard him holler, stop. Frosty the snowman had to hurry on his way, but he waved goodbye and said, don't you cry, I'll be back again someday. Thumpity thump thump thumpity thump thump look at Frosty go. Thumpity thump thump thumpity thump thump over the hills of snow. That concludes Frosty the Snowman, one of my favorite books, one of the holiday traditions in my household. I have read it for you. Hopefully either you can read it to someone else or your parents might read it to you. Have a good evening.